I ask you this first hour, it hit me, but I, I've noticed like at auctions, among kids and churches, whatever it is, a person who has a tendency to accuse, don't you think they're doing something similar to what, that which they're accusing, kind of like the devil's accusing, but he does the same behavior? Don't you think that that happens in our relationships a little bit or in people when they accuse they're actually doing something similar? I don't know how similar it is, but I know it's similar in the fact that it is in sin. And it is, it is their own weakness that they're trying to lift up somebody else's weakness so they can be weak and sinful in their own way and still feel okay about themselves as long as somebody else is worse. That's powerful. Well, the thinker. God hates lies, deceit, flattery, and boasting all through the Scripture. We know that's true. Look at Proverbs chapter 6, verses 17 and 19. Haughty eyes, a lying tongue, hands that shed innocent blood. These are what God hates, what he detests. A false witness who pours out lies, and a man who stirs up dissension among his brothers. It's incredible. Three of the seven things that God says he hates and detests are about our tongue. They're about us speaking in such a way that it doesn't honor God and it uses people. 